This has been the most challenging year our state and the city of Albuquerque has faced. Mayor Tim Keller took time to reflect on some of these challenges like crime in his state of the city address on KOAT. Action 7 News reporter Stella Sun has those details. In spite of the coronavirus, our future is bright. During a state of the city address aired right here on KOAT, Albuquerque Mayor Tim Keller saying he's grateful to turn the page on this year of crisis. Give it our all to make this year, 2021, the year of recovery. But one of the biggest challenges the city faces on the road to recovery, crime. We sat down with Mayor Keller one on one. Albuquerque is on track for record homicides, 23 in 10 weeks. This is going to be a challenge for a while. These crimes are typically very narrowly occurring at the intersection of drugs and domestic violence. Mayor Keller says he's keeping his promise to put crime at the top of his agenda because he's hired 100 new officers each year with another 100 on deck for this year. Newly appointed police chief Harold Medina says APD tripled the size of the homicide unit from five detectives to 16. We have to bring justice to the families and hold criminals accountable. Mayor Keller says new technology will help police fight crime faster. Gunshot detection technology now providing officers with immediate information and locations of shootings. This technology already has led to dozens of arrests and is helping our homicide detectives solve cases. Keller says his administration is investing in public safety and working to rebuild the criminal justice system to be effective. He says this will make Albuquerque safer for all. Albuquerque is not exempt from major city challenges, but here we have the resilience to keep going and the strength to lead with our values through any dark days. Reporting in Albuquerque, I'm Stella Sun, KOAT Action 7 News. So thank you. The city has hired an interim superintendent of police reform to bring candid assessments of APD's reform initiatives.